we're at Milk Tooth, and my name's Mitchell Telstrom, and uh, we're in the Electro Place area, which is sometimes uh, the Fountain Square area of Indianapolis, Indiana. Right now, we're serving the Conduit Espresso Blend from Tinker Coffee Company, which is uh, Los Naranos um, from St. Augustine Wheeler and um, uh, Chiapas. Mod Bar is probably my favorite of all the pressure profiling options that are available for espresso machines. It gives you a lot more control and a lot of real-time control, or I guess a lot of program control rather than delayed real-time control that some of the other machines have. So you can control not just immediate pressure in for line pressure, but you can actually control a maximum pressure, how long it takes to get to that maximum pressure, how much time you spend at that maximum pressure. The coffee scene in Indianapolis, I mean, it's burgeoning, it's new, it's starting. Um, I think the palette is definitely there. There are a lot of options available. Um, or there will be a lot of options available. It's just starting, like, it's just beginning to expand. I think people are starting to think that it doesn't have to be like ordering at a Starbucks. And there's a couple really great companies like really pushing some things forward. Um, it does kind of remind me a little bit of like LA before I got there, where I kind of see that there's going to be a lot of options for, since there aren't a lot of preconceived notions for, you know, the better specialty coffee scene, you'll actually be able to probably, you know, try a lot more things out. I think that was actually the really great part of LA. I mean, I remember, you know, pulling, you know, 58 gram espresso shots. If I would have tried to done that in Portland, people thought I'd be insane. Yeah.